Today I'm going to teach you how to highlight text. Now if you look at this text, it's quite boring. Why don't we put an outer glow around this and make it look really snazzy. So in order to do that, we have to actually go to blending options. But before we do that, if you haven't created a new text layer, you should do that. You can do that by selecting this icon in the bottom right and then selecting text over here and then typing in some text. So once you got that, let's right click and go to blending options. And then we're going to go to outer glow. You guessed it. We're going to click on that. Now, if your blend mode is not set to normal, set it to normal. Um, we're going to pick a solid color. There's also this other option over here where you can create some of these mixed colors. But we're going to do an actual solid color. And let's go with a nice pink, a nice little pink outer glow. There we go. Now, the two main parameters are spread and size. And you'll have to play around with these depending on the size of your text, but it's going to basically control the thickness and how far the highlight leaves the actual text. So in this case, uh, you can see here how this is really altering how this looks on the left. I usually leave the size at about 25 to 30 pixels, but you can play around it. Again, this all depends on the size of the text and the font that you're using. Now, let's go back up here to blend mode. Now, this is where you can really play around. You can select some of these different options here, and it'll change the way this looks. Like one, one that I really like is called exclusion. You see how that reversed everything? But you can play around with these, and you'll get different effects. So we'll go back to normal now. You can go ahead and give the highlight a little bit of an opaqueness to it. And then noise adds grain a little bit more grain to it. So if you want a little bit more of a grain feel, you can bump that up. So you can play around with those options. It's pretty easy as you can see. Please check out my other Photoshop tutorials on my YouTube channel. See you guys later.